Today I'm going to demonstrate some digital object changes in Atom version 2.7. These changes have been made to the digital object metadata sections for both access files and preservation files if dip upload from Archivematica is used. Scroll down to look at the access copies under the digital objects metadata section. You will see it shows more information about the various types of access copies used by Atom. You will see now you have a master file, a reference copy, and a thumbnail copy. These fields can be toggled on and off by an administrator. Should you wish to make changes, you can go to the Admin Visible Elements in the navigation bar. Then scroll down to Digital Objects Metadata Area section and uncheck the blue boxes for more information to be restricted from view. This will only affect the display for unauthenticated or non-logged in users. Logged in users will remain unaffected. The file names for each representation is shown in plain text or in hyperlink. If it is a hyperlink, this means the user has permission to download the representation. If you use DIP upload from Archivematica, you will also be able to see information about preservation copies. This is includes the original file as well as the preservation copy. Information includes file size, file version, and associated file and APUIDs generated within Archivematica, the preservation system. Again, an administrator can toggle on and off different visible elements for unauthenticated users. Once this is done, you'll be able to see that non-logged in users are unable to view certain aspects that have been restricted by the Visible Elements tab. An additional improvement is the ability to download APES, or original files, from Archivematica direct within Atom. This can be done if the Storage Service plugin is enabled and the Storage Service settings in the Admin section are configured. But once this is done, Users with Download 8 permission, by default this is only administrators, they will be able to see Download File and Download 8 buttons next to the UUID. This will allow the user to download the individual file or the whole ape direct from Atom without needing to go into the preservation system. For more information, please visit the Atom documentation.